Hi, it's the uh, 16th and let's uh, do the first market watch at uh, around about 10 a.m. in the morning. Uh, so we can see that companies like Nam India and Alchem, uh, they are in a strong trend. Nam India, uh, we had earlier selected at uh, uh, yesterday and this was a good move. Uh, similarly, we selected, we entered HDFC MC at 3000 and now it's very dear to uh, 3200 levels and uh, it is because of the uh, result uh, move that we have. Uh, similarly, IRCTC also gave us a good move and it seems like uh, there are long positions uh, which are getting added. So for me, I would be uh, tracking the stocks, uh, HTC, MC, Nam India, Alchem and IRCTC as they are in the momentum and maybe going forward they will give us uh, some very good move. Other than that, in the top quadrant, you can see DV's lab uh, is um, really moving uh, great and uh, it is it's good it's, it's, and also is a similar same thing for IRCTC. Uh, Berger Paint also is uh, trying uh, to go above uh, the resistance of 850 and we have to see how it goes from here. Uh, Indus Tower uh, is again had a uh, uh, upper wick at uh, 240 from 240 levels so this might be a good uh, short candidate if uh, 235 levels are reached. Uh, and other than that and if we look for the lower quadrant uh, we can see uh, McDowell India may be a very good uh, reversal candidate and so is also true for Bandhan Bank. Uh, though I will not uh, trade Bandhan Bank uh, because it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's looking uh, really weak right now. Uh, but definitely McDowell uh, India can be uh, McDowell's can be uh, tracked for a uh, reversal Aisha Motor we have already discussed this and uh, we uh, initiated uh, shots at uh, 2690 uh, uh, levels and now it's uh, very near to 2600 levels and it's uh, still looking weak and this is also true for Coromandel uh, Coromandel is uh, yesterday we created shots around about 900 over here in, on, on this day and then eventually in the next two sessions you can see it's uh, near 870 uh, regions and LTI is also not really uh, and so you can see it's in the, in the lowest quadrant it gave an all time high but today it's uh, struggling to move uh, past uh, 4300 and we have to see how uh, things uh, move from here. Uh, the interesting thing over here is if you look into the lower quadrant of my uh, software you will see that all the tech companies like uh, IT companies like Tech Mahindra, LTTS, uh, HCL Tech, CoForge and so definitely IT is not the sector too uh, long or to go and buy in dips that would be really uh, stupid. So let's uh, go forward and try to find uh, which uh, sector is actually uh, moving and try to uh, start with uh, the financials. Uh, so you can see uh, financials and banking so NAM India and HDFC uh, AMC these two we have already picked in the top branch we have uh, uh, India Bull House is not that much um, but again you see uh, we are in the middle and here we have companies like HDFC Bank HDFC over here uh, Mutut Finance also uh, had a fall uh, so it's Kotak uh, Bank is here. So basically, Nifty doesn't look really good if uh, such a structure. Uh, I mean, uh, of course uh, they are at a 0.5, uh, but they are all uh, range bound, and so and as we scroll below, uh, we can see that uh, I created shorts at uh, ICICI two sessions ago, and this is really going good. It was created around about uh, 16 or six levels. And right now it's uh, below, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's uh, 15, 40, it's a day low and this is also true for Chola, uh, State Bank, uh, ICICI Bank, Indusind Bank. So I would definitely suggest that, you know, you should have to have a very uh, pessimistic view of and if you're going forward, if in the lower quadrant you find uh, all the bank, big banks and uh, also the financials are not working. Uh, uh, none of this uh, finance company and you can see uh, Bandhan Banker there are positions uh, which are getting added uh, so and Bajaj Finance also has an upper week uh, so in general uh, try to keep a pessimistic uh, view in Nifty and uh, don't get uh, carried away it, uh, from uh, at the 10 a.m. in the morning the data doesn't look good uh, from uh, auto sector we can see that um, uh, this is good. Tata Motors is finally able uh, is uh, trying to uh, go towards uh, 316, and this is actually a very good sign. And so is also true for companies like uh, 
Bala Krishna Industries, Mother Sansumi. Uh, so at least the auto looks uh, looks good. Uh, TVS motor we had only already discussed yesterday, and it seems like uh, it might. Uh, it's, it's trying to take a support around about at six or five, uh, six ten levels. Uh, so definitely, I in the auto sector, I will be tracking that. Other than that, uh, even the auto sector is uh, all those big red candles. Uh, so it's nothing much uh, we can uh, trade here. Uh, cement. Uh, we were uh, two sessions ago at 2 p.m. I tweeted about cement, and uh, cement has given us a good run from there. Uh, it's uh, Ramco Ultra Ultra cement and grossim uh, is also it it, it uh, looks weak today and uh, but uh, we were making positions in acc especially and we were able to get uh, all time high or 52 week high today and so uh, cement sector is also somewhat uh, and not that much of a great itc is very near as uh, 210 resistance so we have to see how it moves from here uh, now we are in uh, Berger Paint is also trying to move um, but it has an upper wick so I would be uh, skeptical at least for now. Uh, Gothridge of Properties and uh, Hindustan Unilever Titan. So basically you can see that uh, it is more like uh, undecisiveness in whole of this FMCG pack right. Uh, upper wicks, lower wicks, Doji's, Doji, Nestle India, Doji, uh, I want to see Britannia. Uh, Kolpal is definitely uh, not looking good and even uh, Mariko uh, yeah, exactly Britannia see Britannia is also down so uh, sorry this is Bata India and where is Britannia oh Britannia is uh, not in the lower quadrant so this is something very new so I have to find Britannia yeah yeah it has to be right so uh, here you can see it's uh, not able to cross uh, 3500 and this is exactly uh, what I have been uh, telling uh, that uh, Britannia is very weak though there are a lot of people Medico is weak FMCG IT uh, forget auto uh, financials so I don't know which uh, sector is going to move your mif uh, nifty to 16,000 levels oh, and uh, IT is also TCS is only reversing say Vipro is down and so is um, uh, uh so is uh, mine tree in fee emphasis you can see the lower quadrant you have these uh, four or five companies so stay away from uh, it it's not an it day and we have already made a, a good uh, uh, trading uh, we have already taken trading so basically uh, it's okay if one day the sector doesn't run uh, national alum okay let's try to find the next sector you know this is something uh, which uh, this tool should be able to and it seems like uh, at least uh, you know the steel sector is uh, in this upper quadrant of my tool which uh, uh, call india nmdc and what is this uh, hindalco okay hindalco is the okay uh, you remember hindalco we uh, took a trade at uh, 395 yesterday and it went towards uh, 405 so that was a three percent cool trade which we took okay from here we can see that uh, uh, this uh, jindal uh, steel is uh, range bound forget this it, it seems like uh, there is absolutely nothing interesting happening in even in the steel sector though tata steel made an all-time high uh, but still it seems like uh, there is uh, nothing more uh, so this is not even steel that we are okay pharma yeah come on this has to be weird ah devious uh, glenmark uh, sun pharma is able to cross uh, 690 and it went to a 692 uh, 692 is also uh, uh cipla also and uh, granules and apl limited or of pharma lupin no even this uh, it branch doesn't look good because here you will see that uh, though they had a very so if you are actually interested in it i think glenmark uh, 680 is a sort of a resistance and uh it's a uh, it's, 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 it's uh, facing some resistance over here the glenmark is in the top branch and so is dv's lab uh, so we have to see and this is also true for uh, Cipla you can see some pharma Cipla they are trying uh, uh, they are uh, Correcting from the upper levels, uh, but in this uh, pharma pack. I would say if you are interested you can go ahead for 
uh, tracking uh, Sun Pharma, Glenmark, and DBS Lab. But at least the good thing is, all the pharma companies are in the upper quadrant, right? So this is at least uh, showcases that uh, maybe a pharma will be a sector for today. Uh, these are few of the stocks which are in trend: HDFC, MC, uh, Berger Paint, uh, Indus Tower, and IRCTC. IRCTC uh, is uh, definitely unable to cross uh, 240, and we have to see if it is able to maintain the levels of 235. And on the lower quadrant or on the weak side, we have uh, uh, Asian Paint and ABFRL. <coughs> And TVS motor can give us a good uh, reversal and this is also true for uh, Wipro Wipro we traded very good and but uh, unfortunately after result it didn't uh, give it, it moved uh, but uh, it, it didn't move like uh, LTTS of course this is a, <laughs> a large cap company so you can't easily uh, move it and uh, Aisha motor also uh, is trying to get us uh, some uh, reversal from uh, two six uh, uh, two zero levels and Coromandel is looking uh, weak also. So uh, yeah, and uh, strong trending are Alchem and Nam India on the long side and on the short side we have uh, uh, Bandhan Bank which is also trying to you know reverse from uh, the three hundred and fifteen levels so we can keep a track on this and uh, also uh, McDowell is uh, trying to get a support from uh, 640 levels so for today i will uh, try to track my double for uh, a reversal <coughs> and that's it so uh, and just to uh, conclude uh, let me have a look and try to find the company on the sector so if i look into the top quadrant uh, we have Yeah, so from uh, the sector, I think uh, pharma would be a sector uh, which uh, we should uh, stick with, uh, and we should definitely not uh, trade. Uh, uh, we should definitely not uh, try to make long positions in IT. And uh, but if I look into the top quadrant, I can see <coughs> most of the uh, pharma companies. Uh, so and so going forward, I think uh, today might be a pharma day. So try to stick with uh, Glenn, Mark, Alchem, Davis Lab, uh, which you see over here in the Sun Pharma, right? And I think uh, this would be uh, also steel is the second sector which I would be uh, uh, st having a look at uh, because you have uh, Tara Steel over here, Vedanta over here, Sale over here, Jindal Steel over here. So maybe a uh, steel sector would be also uh, the second uh, sector. So the two sectors which I would be interested in is uh, uh, steel and uh, pharma. So uh, and if we want, uh, we can do a quick uh, look into how uh, uh, Nifty uh, 50 is uh, poised. Uh, this is some. Okay, yeah, so this is how Nifty 50 uh, is looking. So in the top branch, uh, we have DVs over here. We have DVs and ITC uh, and uh, Sun Pharma, uh, Tata Steel, Cipla, Tata Motors and Bharati. Uh, these are all in the top quadrant and towards the uh, mid, we have Reliance uh, facing a resistance at 2100. Uh, this is also a known thing and also Coal India and here you have uh, a lot of uh, HDFC Life, uh, Titan, Hindustan Unilever and you can see uh, Dr. Reddy over here and uh, going below we have a branch of uh, big uh, names uh, here you can see LT uh, Britannia so LT is also trying to get a support at 1600 levels it's at all time high and uh, Britannia and Wipro State Bank of India, Access Bank, yeah, ICICI Bank, Indusind Bank, uh, Infi is also trying to get a, a support from lower levels. But yeah, uh, so I won't be uh, too much. Uh, <coughs> I won't, sorry, I won't be too much optimistic on Nifty front because uh, uh, theoretically, 
you can see all the big names are in this lower quadrant uh, which have a uh, weightage and especially the banking and financials hope this uh, market watch extensive market watch report is going to help you in, in planning your trade for this uh, session and my best of luck to you bye bye